Simon Graham and the Extraordinary Timepiece is a puzzle game that takes some of its cues from the super popular Professor Layton series on the Nintendo DS. It's just not as polished. The game is a mix of puzzles from word puzzles, picture puzzles, logic puzzles, and the most dreaded puzzle of them all, dun dun dun, math puzzles. These are all neatly tied up in a pretty lame storyline about a boy trying to save his kidnapped grandmother from a dark and mysterious figure. Kidnapped grandmother? Really? The Victorian art is simple and cool, but has no bearing on the game whatsoever, other than making me feel like they're trying to cash in on the whole steampunk thing. The music, on the other hand, is the most elaborate thing about the game. But having said that, thank God for the mute option, because after a few minutes, the repetition just made me want to throw the iPod out the window. As for gameplay, I wish I could comment on it, but I can't, because there is none. Other than a few button clicks and finger swipes, there isn't much in the way of gameplay. The game did keep me entertained for a while, and some of the puzzles are pretty cool. There are a few that are a bit challenging, so if at first you don't succeed, try try again. Or, do what I do, and just hit the skip puzzle button. If you're really into thinking games that are clever and challenging, then I say go for it. But as for me, the last thing I want in a video game is math. This is JetWithAtV.com, your definitive source for iPad and iPhone reviews.